the heat rolling in, you're going to want to avoid cooking today or at least being around, you know, like a hot grill or something. Luckily for us, the general manager of Yard House in Troy, Nathan Scheffler, is here and making one of the season's trendiest foods, the poke bowl. Thanks for coming in this morning. Thanks so much for having me. I love poke. It is so light. It's cooling. It's refreshing. It's good stuff. It is. It's excellent. So, you know, before we dive in real quick, I just want to say thank you again for having me. I'm Nathan Scheffler, general manager at Yard House Restaurant. Um, you know, we have so with if you're anything like me, especially in the summer heat, right? You really love to enjoy a cold beverage uh, with some great food. So, yeah. you know, our, our beer lovers out there really like to try the new trends and uh -huh. still stick with their classics. So at Yard House, we have the world's largest draft beer selection. Uh -huh. um, we've just recently, with our summer fest, introduced 25 new beers at every location. So, okay, great. Uh, we've got something for everybody out there. But let's go I ahead and dive it. right let's in. Let's get to the poke. So explain if people may not have had a poke before. What is poke? It's a native Hawaiian dish mm -hmm. uh, made with poke, uh, poke, which is uh, the, which is going to be. Um, sashimi grade raw ahi tuna. Okay. So we're going to start with a large handful of arugula placed in the center of our dish. All right, nice and peppery. How it sets arugula. ours apart is typically this is uh, going to be made as a rice bowl. But we do a, a crispy rice cake. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take our wonton chips here, put them in the bowl. Okay. And then we're going to go around and kind of add our ingredients. So we've got our cucumbers, masago. And what is that? That's just um, uh, fish eggs. Fish eggs, yeah. right? Okay. We've got nori strips, we've got our seaweed salad. I love it. It's just like a little little sampling of a bunch of is, delicious yes. flavors here. We've got avocado, um, edamame, got the baby tomatoes. The best part of all is this poke, and this is uh, married with uh, with sambal and uh, so, um, soy. We're gonna put that right on top there. Nice. Garnish it with a little crispy garlic. And is this a, a pretty big hit at, at your place? A lot of no, people absolutely. love the poke. Very popular, yeah. yes. We also have poke nachos, which are phenomenal. Oh, poke nachos, too. We're going to drizzle that. If you want to go ahead and finish this off, we're going to drizzle right over the top. Okay. And Orange. what is this? That's our sriracha aioli. Ah, oh, okay. Use a little of this here. So you're getting like a little bit of spice, too. Absolutely. A, little, a lot of sweetness in there, a little bit of mm -hmm. heat. Yum. And we've got our soy vinaigrette here as well. Oh, and that you can just pour right over. Delicious. And so, what else? Uh, what else do you have here that you that you brought? So let's talk beer wise real quick. This pairs very well with our Yard House uh, Cuvee. Okay. This is brewed especially for us. It's a blend of three different Belgian beers that goes well with just about anything on our menu. Um, we also have our a lot of local selections. We've got mm -hmm. the Rochester Mills uh, Pine Knob Pilsner over here. Uh, we're doing. We've got our four pack samplers. Uh, food wise, we've got our. We're featuring our Curaboda pork burger as well. And mm. our tropical chicken um, tacos. Mm. All right, I got to take a taste right here. And what's your favorite part about uh, about the poke bowl? Would you say? Uh, just the freshness of it, and just the pop of so many different flavors and colors. It's mm. it's really phenomenal. It's really really good. And and what about making this at home? What do you need to keep in mind? Uh, just keep in mind that you're gonna, you're looking for sashimi grade ahi tuna, mm -hmm. and that's really the key component of that dish. And again, traditionally it's it's like a rice bowl. Yeah. And I mean, as you can see, there's a tremendous amount of great fresh ingredients, and in that you can really kind of customize, you know, to your preference. Oh, that soy stuff is really it's really delicious. It is. And you've got something going on on Monday too when it comes yes. to the beer. Yes. Yeah. So uh, and celebrating our summer beer fest right now on Monday, if you come on in and join us, we're doing our four pack beer samplers of any beers on our tower for five dollars. Oh, nice. All right. And so tell us where you're located? We're located um, at, at Crooks and Big Beaver, not too far away from Somerset Collection. All right, thanks so much for coming in so this morning and bringing me. all this food. And Kevin, we'll send it over to you. And uh, something cool would be nice on such a hot day.